Hey y'all, what's up, what's up? I'm here in our YouTube video today. Today's video is going to be about two U.S. soldiers killed in Afghanistan. I waited a couple days to do this so I could get their names and information. Um, it was an insider attack. They did both die from combat-related injuries. Um, it happened in Tarang Court, which is in the southern part of Afghanistan. 20-year-old uh, Brandon J. Kreischer of Stryker, Ohio was killed. And 24-year-old Michael Isaiah Nance of Chicago was also killed. Uh, now, I do want to uh, give these people the credit they deserve um, and announce their awards because they have a lot of awards, um, including the Purple Heart. They both earned that. Now, 24-year-old Michael Isaiah Nance, he has a Purple Heart Award, the Bronze Star Medal Award, Army Service Ribbon, Global War on Terror Service Medal, Combat Infantryman Badge, and Basic Parachutist Badge. Now to get the Purple Heart, you know, that's a really big honor. Um, some of these might have, or classes, I'm sure, like the parachuting and stuff. But to get the Purple Heart, that's a big honor. Uh, Bronze Star Medal is a big honor. Army Service Ribbon. Um, now, 20-year-old Brandon J. Kreischer was awarded the Purple Heart, the Bronze Star Medal, Afghan Campaign Medal, um, Global War on Terror Service Medal, and Basic Parachutist Badge. So they were both very decorated people. Uh, you know, they were both uh, at station at Fort Bragg until they got put over there in Afghanistan. Now, uh, 13 people or 12 people have been killed this year compared to 13 last year. You know, there's still five months to go. You know, there's not much you can do to bring these people out. You know, they're pretty much fighting to keep us safe. So, when this main reason I, you know, stand up for the flag, uh, unlike these other people, you know, the flag is a symbol of our country, okay? symbol of our country. It represents the men and women that have died for our country and for the people that are still over there. You know, the 20-year-old, 24-year-old left behind his mother or, and father and the 20-year-old left behind his wife. You know, these people all have families too, just like us. Uh, they all have their own lives lived, you know, they're all grown just like us. So when people, you know, step on the flag and burn it and say they don't ever do nothing and, and Da, da, da. You know, that, that's really disrespectful. You know, in all honesty, there should be a law where either they have to join the army for a year, find out what it's like to be on the front lines, or leave the country. Simple as that. You know, if you don't have enough respect for this country, then you need to either A, join the army, find out what it's like, or B, just leave. Simple as that. Um, but with that being said, you know, uh, prayers out for these people's family, um, you know, keep them in your thoughts and prayers and thank y'all for watching.